What's up guys? Tony Skinjio here. I want to do a quick video about Kestrel because that's what everyone's doing. Uh, and uh, I've watched a lot of videos so far and I've played with her a little bit. And uh, I've seen a lot of people talking about how she's amazing and she's OP and, you know, game changing. You know me. I don't like to say the same thing everyone else is saying. But I don't disagree, right? I think she's a really good character. I think she... Uh, has a lot of high impact stuff in the game. Um, so instead, I wanted to do like a little bit of a different type of video. Uh, and again, no, I really don't want to go into what ISOs you want to put on her, or what tier fours are important. To me, that's not, it's not really the point. The character's good, and again, that information's already out there. I don't think it's very relevant. And I don't want to go into you know, the design of the character. I think it looks pretty cool, and I think it's cool that she has a shield logo, and I think she's cool as a cosmic tech skill blaster. Great. Um, and I don't want to go into her release method, which we all know at this point is going to be a campaign, and it's a relatively easy campaign. It's the Voyager tag. We get it, right? She's a good character. Uh, I, I really just kind of wanted to do a video because I have an opinion on Kestrel, and I... I just want to make sure that some other people hear it from me, uh, just in case you want to watch my videos anyway. Um, it's real simple, right? Fuck Kestrel. That's it. This is fuck her. Like, this... I don't... She doesn't need to exist. Um, this character never needed to be made this way. Um, sets a terrible precedent. For the fact that you can have a great deal of value going forward, and then you can create a character like her that pretty much limits the amount of design space you can have in the future regarding characters who like summon um, one new character coming out that does a lot of damage against multiple legendary and hard to get characters. Uh, and of course, metas change, right? And you know, things that were strong in the past wouldn't necessarily be strong in the future. And I understand that. And of course, that doesn't apply everywhere. Like, you're not only ever gonna, you're never gonna not use Phoenix again. You know, these characters still have value, the characters that, but ultimately, fuck her. Fuck them for designing her. Um, fuck the release. Uh, the fact that basically now the game is going to be defined. Even more so based on the people who have an incredibly strong version of this character in particular and the people who don't are going to be separated. I don't like it. So, yep, that's the take I wanted you to, to have from this. Fuck Kestrel. That's it. Have a good night, guys.